Hello, everybody, and happy Friday to you. I do not have any TTMs today. My in-person season hasn't started yet, but I do have an auction win. Uh, this is actually from Sport Lots, and they have an auction section. And I don't think a lot of people know about it because there's some pretty good deals to be had in there. I think I got a pretty good deal on, on what's in here. Uh, they only have you know, a couple hundred baseball items or whatever at any given point. But um, there's still some things listed in there, I think. Yeah, this is a pretty good deal. I've got <clears throat> some good deals. Um, so let's cut into this here. Invoice. Okay. I very much prefer blue painter's tape. But if cards arrive safely, I'm generally pretty happy. Sometimes it's more work than you want it to be but like I said we want cards arriving safely that's paramount then we complain about which type of tape people used okay so these are 2016 oh boy my camera is hold on I'm gonna make an adjustment here 2016 uh, archive snapshots and I believe these are online exclusives um, Someone who knows more about that can comment below or, or fill me in. Um, but I've got, I think there's 10 of them here. Let's check it out. <clears throat> I got 10, and there's only like 22 cards in this in this set. So if I were to get all of them. Uh, the, other, the other part of the set has bigger names in it. Um, I think you can get Bryant and a couple guys like that. So these are sort of more your common players. But I got 10 cards for 31 bucks delivered. So if you figure these are an average of $3.10 each. On-card autos of... There's some really good players in here. There's some sort of more common guys, uh, as you'll see. But I'm pretty happy for a little over $3 each. You get nice on-card autos. They're, most of them are numbered. So let's check it out. Um, AJ Pollock, it would be great if he could... Stay on the field. Very talented. That's numbered to 300. Hand numbered. Diamondbacks uniform, obviously. Jose Peraza. <clears throat> rookie card. That uh, one's numbered to 100. I'm not sure what the distinction is. Uh, the... Boy, they look really similar. I, maybe it's because it's a rookie. It's lower numbered. I don't know. But uh, here we go. Carl Edwards Jr. Still with the Cubs. Number to 350. BJ Surhoff in an Orioles uniform. Number to 350. Ryan Klesko in a Padres. You know, I think of the Braves when I think of Klesko. <clears throat> but if you go and look up his baseball reference page... He actually played more games with the Padres. Um, it's really funny you get in your 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 mind that a certain player is is have more heavily associated with a certain team. But Klesko is a Padre, and sure enough, here he's pitching with the Padres. Oh, and that is uh, doo -doo -doo, 350. I think most of the rest are numbered to 350. Oscar Gamble, who we lost, I think last year, he uh, passed away fairly recently. Uh, greatest fro of the 70s. Look up his 76 tops traded card. And it's it's a thing to behold. But colorful guy. And really had a pretty decent career. Oh, the, yep, 300. Rob Ref Snyder, Yankees. Number to 350. Um, really hasn't done much with his career. I'm not even sure. I'm sure he's not still with the Yankees. I don't know what he's up to now, but... Um, he was really hyped up, of course, because he was a Yankee prospect, but <clears throat> fortunately hasn't made much of a career for himself. Brian Johnson, Red Sox, that's a rookie. Number to 350. I still have not figured out why. Here we have rookies that are numbered to 100, some 350. I'm going to find this Peraza again. If you know what the difference is between these cards, please help me out. I just don't see it. 
There's no different colored border. The text is the same. Um, I don't know, the naming uh, convention is the same on the set number. Anyway, interesting. Bob Boone, who uh, not long after I became a baseball fan, was got the record for most games caught for a career. And he was since passed by Pudge Rodriguez and somebody else, I think. But I always think of that when I think of Bob Boone, because I remember watching that this week in baseball where he became the all-time all -time catcher dude. But he's a cool guy, uh, obviously the father of Aaron Boone and Brett Boone. And last but not least, another baseball dad, Sandy Alomar Sr., father of Roberto Alomar and Sandy Alomar Jr. This is the first uh, Sandy Sr. auto I've ever had, I think. So I'm really happy to get this. And like I said, I got these for about $3.10 each. So how did I do? How did I do? Boone, Peraza Rookie, Johnson, Pollock, Alomar Sr., Ref Snyder Rookie, Oscar Gamble, that's probably my favorite one there. Klesko, Surhoff, and Carl Edwards Jr. Nice mix of current and retired players. Uh, comment below if you know if you know more about how these. Uh, uh, like I said, I think they're online exclusive, but you're gonna tell me because we got smart smart baseball fans on YouTube. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.